Hey, Beach Church. It may be a new year, but our mission is still the same, to reach, raise up, and release followers of Jesus who change the world. I'm Katie, and this is our Winter Recap. This past winter, we reached people through our worship services and message series, encouraging them to recognize and pursue a relationship with Jesus. We also saw people take their first steps with Jesus with Beach Church at our Welcome to Beach party. Hi, I'm Cesar Sastry and I moved to the Ponte Vedra Beach along with my wife Patty and my daughter Karen in late 2020. We attended the Welcome to Beach Zoom party and we were very excited to learn about all the interesting ministries the church is involved in and how they are serving our community. We look forward to joining in and serving along with you here at the beach. We had a blast raising up the next generation to follow Jesus in our beach kids and beach student environments, as well as investing in future leaders through our internship. We also got to come alongside people in their pursuit of Jesus through discipleship environments like life groups and starting point. Another way we raised up followers of Jesus was through our 21 day fast. Each morning we encouraged people to participate in a daily message, worship and reflection time, journaling through this journey with Jesus. At the end of this fast, we celebrated together with a powerful worship night, thanking God for his goodness and his faithfulness. Hi, my name is Karen and I moved to Ponte Vedra Beach in late 2020. I was looking for some community before I started law school and I'm so thankful to have joined a life group here at Beach. It's been a blessing to me with the Girls Weekly and read the Bible together and really grow in the Lord. Hi, I'm Alicia and I'm part of the online campus. I loved the community aspect of the 21-day fast. A verse that became meaningful to me at that time was from Titus 3.1, which says to be ready to do good. And finally, this winter, we released people to share the love of Jesus, both locally and across the world. We teamed up with local organizations to be for our community through events like our sock and underwear drive and our Christmas Day lunch with our homeless friends. Hi guys, Mike Kozlowski here. Uh, wanted to share that we had the opportunity to serve uh, meals on Christmas Day at the church. Uh, part of kind of church's uh, identity is to reach, raise up, release followers of Christ to change the world. And for me and my family, it was an opportunity for us to take out of our uh, Christmas morning and to go serve the homeless and uh, show the love of Christ. Hey everyone. This is Matthew, and I'm so excited that I got to serve with the sock and underwear drive this past Christmas. It was so wonderful seeing all the people who want to be the hands and feet of Jesus and donating socks and underwear and other needed items to Mission House for homeless people. The whole reason we look back and celebrate God's faithfulness over seasons like this past winter is so that we can have confidence in Him moving forward so that we can remember and know that He is good, that He is in control, and that He is so incredibly worthy of our praise. Now let's keep reaching, raising up, and releasing people to follow after Jesus together.